what's up guys, it's Big Rack here bringing you a brand new video. We're here on Forza 7. We're gonna be building a drift car. Uh, I did this series a little bit last uh, Horizon 3, I think it was, where I showed you guys what I do to build a, a car, like a drift car, proper drift car. We won't be tuning in this video. Oh, I wanna look at the, uh, cause there's apparently there's a white body kit for this. I wanna see what it looks like. Ooh, maybe. All right, let's look what kind of bumpers. Although a stock body FC looks fucking dope. Uh, let's put the wide body kit on. Let's follow the trend. And then we will, um, Well, that's no fun. Well, that's no fun. Uh, I definitely like the wingless. Look, that's dope. Definitely that hood. Oh, I love it, actually. Okay, let's go ahead and upgrade brakes. You guys say the brakes aren't necessary. They're necessary since I'm on a wheel. Um. Actually, since I'm on a wheel, my brakes on my wheel are like really, really, really stiff. So I upgrade the brakes and put the pressure up pretty high so I can actually don't have to slam on it to break my pedal, you know. That's just how it is. Uh, we're going to hold off on weight reduction because we'll have to figure out what kind of tire we can run on the amount of horsepower we're going to run. I don't know exactly what we're looking at. Oh, no. All right, let's see what kind of wheels we want. I don't know what wheels I want to run. I think those will fit. I like them. Seventeens in the front. Let's do a 240 setup essentially. So 17s in the front, 18s in the back. It'll it'll look dope. Trust me. Alright, what can we fit tire ways in the rear? We can go up to a 295. Wow, okay. Alright. I may get some hate. Just might get some hate because strongly leaning towards a uh, V8 swap on this. Screw it. V8 swap the world. Um, probably gonna get some hate on that one too, but uh, supercharger it is. Alright, so we're gonna look for probably around seven. I don't want to upgrade supercharger. It looks like it's very pleasable to push seven on this car. I can probably 750 used to be a good number. I'm really curious. 889. Screw it. If we need to, we can always go back to stock supercharger, but that works. All right, so I am weighing in at 3,200. Get that down to 3,000. Okay, yeah. Get that down to 3,000. So then we can. Oh, I forgot to change this tire even. Always put sport tires on. Always. Alright, rear width. 
3,000 pounds. Oh, I thought that up. Give it a minute. But we're back. We can actually run a 295. So that's perfect. Right where we need to be. Um, we may build the shale off the 64 pounds because we only have to weigh 3,000 pounds. Um, you're probably going to ask how I'm going to do that. I'm going to try. Yeah, 15 pounds right there. Um, yeah, pretty much. So that's going to be that. Um,. We'll throw just a cent. I'll show you guys some of the basics. I'm not too great at tuning. Uh, me and Manji actually get together probably later and we'll fine tune a little bit because he's re he's decent, really good actually at tuning. All right, so you're gonna want your differential to 60/40. Um, break. I'm gonna run probably more front with a uh, 58. And a 120 brake pressure. This is because I run a wheel. But uh, dampening, go a little bit stiffer. Springs, just because, you know. Roll bars will leave that. Um, negative 2.5 normally in the front. And then we'll go positive. Could be up to 9, which we will probably try about 8. I think it'll work. Gearing, I'm going to leave for right now. We'll apply that. Just go give it a rip, see, what, see how it is. Fuck, through too much angle. But yeah, I have Mike in this car. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like down below. It helps the channel grow and it helps me stay motivated. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one where we're going to be creating graphics for this beast. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll see you guys.